Hello guys, my name is Luca from Audio Tribe YouTube channel and in this video I will make an unboxing with the Sony headphones and I will give you my first impressions. First, let's start with the Sony WH-1000XM3 and second with the Sony WH-1000XM5. This is the, should be the, the best model on the market under 1000 euros. So let's start and see what we have in the boxes. So some papers, we have this cool basket and inside of it we have the jack to connect the phones with uh, a device and remember I used these speakers for about three years and this is how they look this you can replace but this you cannot replace see that's why I bought this like this so after these three years I um, what can I say they are very good uh, even now they hold uh, between 25 or 30 hours of playing time after these three years that I have used this uh, these headphones uh, I can say that these are one of the best headphones that I used um, and uh, the XM4 in my opinion doesn't worth it because uh, the upgrade is very is very little but when the Sony released the Sony WH-1000XM5 I said this should be the ones to replace this old model so inside of the of the box it came with a USB Type-C cable but that one is broken so now let's see what we have in the new model and give you my my first impressions after using the XM3 so at first you can see that the box is almost similar a little bit bigger and this one cost about 380 dollars brand new 1000 x series and here is the pouch it's down so we have this books manuals that no one reads okay let's put it aside this pouch is very cool but compared to the XM3 or the XM4 because they are similar it's, it is much bigger here we can place something but this doesn't have and inside the XM3 the speakers go inside very well like this and with a cable like this and let's see how is the XM5 branded with Sony very cool thing and remember this is the Sony WH XM 1000 XM5 here we have a magnetic door with a, a jack to jack cable that is branded with Sony 
this one is not branded the same Sony charging cable this is a cool feature and these are the speakers Ooh. they are very very beautiful in my opinion brand new so what can we say the box is bigger this is not an issue for me because it's not that big than the this one but unfortunately as you can see the xm3 and the xm4 5 uh, 4 as you can see the xm3 and the xm4 can be folded just like this but the xm5 can't be folded it stays just like this so when you place it on the on the table on the bed or wherever you want it's a uh, it takes a lot of space but let's see unfolded how they are unfolded uh, the xm3 it's a little bit bigger the cups are almost similar no the xm5 has a little bit bigger gaps they are turning they are turning almost all the way yeah and if you need you can adjust the length with this thing while the xm5 has a new technology so they are similar but unfortunately i don't like very much the how they hmm. oh, it's okay but the folding uh, the folding uh, side it's uh, it's a minus for me because i left on the on the subwoofer the jbl subwoofer just like this i am not using this at my home while the the headphones the new headphones it will stay i don't know i guess i will use the pouch so let's turn them on you will see here they both have the noise cancelling button with ambient and the on and off button so let's turn them on two seconds and already they entered in pairing mode now let's see how they feel on the on the on the head the noise isolation is very very good it's almost similar the noise isolation but when you hit when you hit the the headphones the the sound doesn't doesn't go in the side the cup so that is a big plus on the side on the right side you have a, a touchpad that you can swipe to control the volume 
and as they said on the on the on the boxes this should charge for three hours to play uh, to play uh, uh, this should charge for 10 minutes to play three hours and this should charge in five minutes to to play three hours both have 30 hours of playing time and after uh, after i am using this for a couple of days i will give you uh, my impressions on if if they worth it to upgrade the the sony mx3 or um, XM3 or they doesn't worth it because the sound is not that different only the package is different you know just like the phones they are they're almost identical at this point uh, in my opinion you need to make a big improvement in technology to step up the game I don't know I will give you my uh, my impressions after a couple of days of using these two headphones but these for three years they are almost just like, like brand new no problem no nothing just this this sponge doesn't replace so feel free to subscribe audio tribute to channel and please hit the like button cheers